Rifle and muzzleloader season is right around the corner, and Pennsylvania's Game Commission is warning about two common diseases spreading among deer. One of the diseases already affected a scheduled archery hunting spot in Lancaster County earlier this year. Fox 43's Matt Kleindance examines if the outbreaks will impact upcoming hunting seasons. Another round of deer hunting is starting soon, and the Pennsylvania Game Commission is notifying hunters about two viruses affecting deer populations, episodic hemorrhagic disease and blue tongue virus. The diseases were found in deer at Middle Creek Wildlife Management Area in Lancaster and Lebanon counties back in September. There were several deer discovered, and two deer were, samples were removed from two deer, and EHD was determined to be the cause of death. The outbreak caused a scheduled archery hunt in Middle Creek to be canceled as the Game Commission monitored the spread of the disease among the herd. Dustin Stoner with the Game Commission says the diseases are common among white-tailed deer and can cause a significant number of deaths during the outbreaks. The relative you know, die-off in that area was somewhere around what we can determine to be around 50 deer. Stoner says the upcoming rifle and muzzleloader seasons are unlikely to be affected as the colder weather kills off the insects that spread the disease. Any deer that survived the initial outbreak won't likely make it through the winter. There just may be some minor signs that may look a little odd to, to hunters if they harvest a deer that has survived that disease. Stoner says hunters can protect themselves from any parasites or diseases found in deer by wearing protective gloves and goggles when harvesting deer. Keep yourself protected. Um, if you harvest an animal that just looks sickly or doesn't look right or smells, you know, um, different. Any hunters that have concerns while harvesting deer can contact the Game Commission. Matt Kleindens, Fox 43 News.